intake laying on the ground right there. Got a Corvette back there on jack stands. Sketchy. Ah, come on. All right. Come on. Woo. The Eagle has landed. I'm the world's best backwards driver. All right, now that we're in the light, we got a little bit of, or now that we're in the shop and got a little bit of light, that's better. I can show y'all the reason for today's video. I had a guy approach me in Harbor Freight parking lot. By the way, I called it Tractor Supply like a hundred times in this video, so I apologize for being stupid. But Adam approached me in the parking lot and fixed all the body damage that was on my truck. That, he fixed a crease in my door here, a ding there. He fixed a big major crease in my hood and then also fixed this cab corner back here. It was pretty bad. He fixed all this and left it in primer so basically it's ready to be painted or wrapped one of the two so let me know in the comments what color y'all would like to see this truck wrapped i think i'm gonna get it wrapped that's what i want to do so it was pretty insane he just approached me he's like hey man that's a pretty bad dent you got in your truck i bet you want that fixed don't you i was like duh and he said mind if i take a look at it i said sure why not he said he could do everything for like 600 bucks and have it done in one afternoon and i was like dude there is no freaking way you're actually about to do that so he did and he impressed the crap out of me fixed my whole truck one afternoon so i'm gonna let y'all see that enjoy today's video guys it's a good one and by the way the corvette i know you guys are wondering it runs That's the only teaser you guys are gonna get for now. Be sure to hit subscribe and watch the next videos because the next videos coming up are going to be awesome. I promise it's in a whole different league. You're just gonna have to trust me. Be patient because good things are coming. Enjoy today's video. Yeah. All right, guys. So I just got a tractor supply. I'm going in here to buy a whole bunch of tools and in the parking lot, this guy passes by in this truck. This is Tom right here. Hey. And as y'all know, my truck is pretty messed up and this man, Want to get it ready for paint for him within maybe an hour or two. He said he's going to get all this done. I don't see how you're going to do that. Man, that's crazy. Seeing is believing, my friend. All right. And then there's a dent right here. Dent on the hood up here. And this man says he's going to do all this and get my truck ready within an hour. I said, hold on. Let me grab my camera because this is insane. <laughs> so I'm going to go inside, tractor supply, and do what I was planning on doing and go get me some tools. And then whenever I get back, we'll see how much he guys done. Then he's going to follow me down to the shop and do the rest in the parking lot. So we'll see how this goes. Good luck, Tom. I'm gonna be amazed. I'm gonna be amazed? I promise you that. All right, Dan. All right, we'll be back going inside Tractor Supply. So I'm inside Tractor Supply, and this man is legit out there working on this thing. This is, this is wild. I hope he fixes the crap out of it. I already told him, I said, if you actually fix this thing today, I will give you extra money. But he says he can do it all for $600 and have it done within a matter of hours today. Kind of sketchy, but it's okay. I'm fine with that. We'll see. All right, let's go check this out. Oh my right. God, it's bad. It's bad? What? You know, you still have the little waves right in here. Uh-huh. That's when the body filler comes in. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm pretty damn impressed. It's been what, like 20 minutes? Maybe. Probably about that. It took me longer to take out the generator. <laughs> Golly. All right, so you can. That's pretty damn straight. It's definitely still got a little bit of ripples in it. But you said. Oh, yeah, you know, that's when the body. You're going. You're going. You're going to get the body filler out and get that that part done. Mm -hmm. That's why I told you right in here, the small guy. I'm gonna body fill this. Since we're in there, I'll throw this guy in there for you. Okay. You're getting the whole truck wrapped, and all I gotta do is have shape this, grind it down, basically fill it. Don't take it too long, huh? Okay, while you're here, I got you something else. I'm gonna add to the job, okay? All right. All right, I got I got this dent right here when this truck had like 500 miles on it. It's right on the cab corner. What do you think about it? I could take it out. The thing is on this, I'm gonna have to make a small excision right here. I'm gonna have to drill you a hole. Okay. To take out the pressure. But it's point. gonna be filled back in with body filler though. Yeah. Okay, well that's fine. We'll get this thing ready for paint or wrap, one of the two. Whatever it, your truck, it's your preference. Yeah, right? Well, I, did, I pulled in Tractor Supply, or not Tractor Supply, I pulled in Harbor Freight today. I did not know I was gonna get a new truck. Hey, brother. Hey, I'm, I'm gonna get this toolbox loaded up. 
and then you can just follow me on out. We're gonna hit the interstate and go uh, west. Alrighty. Alrighty. This is by far the craziest thing that's happened to me this week. I think. Actually, I've had some pretty crazy things happen to me this week. But this is pretty nuts. Y'all can see the bed side of my truck has been, I don't know, probably about 75% repaired, minus paint. We're gonna get the rest done here in just a second. See y'all at the shop. All right, guys, just got back to the shop. Man followed me all the way here. Hey, you got you gotta you gotta forgive me about my camera stuff, but this is just no, strange right, to me. Man. What do you do? Uh, race car and YouTube. Really? Yeah, that's my bed up there. Come check it out. I'll give you the shop tour. Just just uh just make sure you don't try to screw me over, come back and steal my stuff or something. Oh no way. Hey, I've got I got extension cords. I'm good. This man said he, he, he's got his own generator. This is how he did this in the parking lot a while ago. I know y'all didn't see this, but in the parking lot, he broke his generator out and he had this sander going in the parking lot of Harbor Freight. You gotta do what you gotta do. So while he was here, I told him I already had a dent on this side and he said he's gonna fix this one too. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hold on, wait. Nice little dent in the corner cab. Make it look worse for him. <laughs> yeah, make it look worse, drill a couple holes in it. This is actually, I had this, I got this one that had paper plates on the truck. Oh, that probably pissed you off. Oh man, see my buddy was driving and uh, and we were we were backing up real fast going down the road and he kind of got too close to the edge and just sm smoked the mailbox. Okay. Bottom's really does the rest. Not too shabby. Man's gonna make me fall in love with my truck again. Hopefully. Ain't no hopefully. This thing needs to be brand new. Got those little ones sanded out. He's gonna body fill those. And then I think the last one is this one on the hood right here. You see, it's pretty nasty. Now we just gotta fill in the little crease. Got a body filled. Still ain't smooth, but not too shabby. You do this often? Yep. Just like this? Just like this. Now don't kid yourself. You got a lot of people doing it. You got some good people and you got some bad people. Yeah. And that's why with my work, there's no money up front till my job is done. All my work speaks for itself. Well, yeah, that, that's really what got me is in the parking lot. You said, I don't need no money up front. Just let me do it. Seeing is believing. 100%. All right. Looks like you're grading cheese. So that's what everybody calls them cheese grater starting to mass this thing up yep starting to mass it up ready for get primer her, get her done hey that looks great how bad would it be if i just went uh, well, if your hands are greasy <laughs> <laughs> they are very greasy Woo. that is so much better that's crazy i really thought i was gonna need a new hood you know i thought i was about to have to get new body panels and everything for that this man has amazed me i've already went and got a quote done on this thing and it was like right at four thousand dollars is what the body shop quoted me to do this and then i have a whopping one thousand dollar deductible because they love me so much and it was just really random i just you just ran up to me in the parking lot and said hey man it's a nice dent you got in your truck you probably want that fixed don't you yeah yeah that'd be nice <laughs> we always meet by purpose it's never accident that's right that's right Sixty-five thousand dollar truck with a spray paint can <laughs> the only spot i see back here just a little bit off is just that little corner right, right there. there and then there's well, always a little up. tiny one right there. It still's got to be block sand. Block sand. Right, but if I get it wrapped, that doesn't need to be there. You ain't going to see none of that. I feel like it would lay on it. You don't think you so? You ain't going to see it because the wrap is like right now if I was to get taped, tape it across there, you ain't going to see that, that blemish. And plus, the primer is still thin. You ever seen a, a girl do her nails? Uh, you know when it's freshly painted, you see those lines. But when you put them in that little boot, everything's nice and cured. So the primer, it's going to still activate that, you know what I mean? You're, it's not going to be as noticeable, but you're still going to similar see it. Okay, okay. Yeah, guys, let me know in the comments what you think I should do. Should I get this thing wrapped or should I get it painted back its original color? Not really sure. If I get it wrapped, I'm thinking like a matte, frost, silver, metallic. That's like a lot of words in one, but like basically a matte silver with a metallic flake in it. So it's kind of what I was thinking. Not really sure yet. You got steady hands. Think so? Yeah, spray paint better than I do. Once you start painting with a can or even a compressor, once you follow the flame that's thrown out, once you follow it, you 
get the hang of it. All right, so what are you doing exactly right now? Right now we got it basically primed, and now we're putting a painter's guy coat on it. It's just a regular primer. See these dots? Once they block sand it, you cut it all down. Once the dots are gone, you're ready for your paint. Okay, okay. So make everything even, get all the high and low spots, cut down. Well, that is a dent fix, my friends. It is a dent be gone. So he already got this one black over here. He's gonna put that painter's guide coat over here as well. Let's see, what's the front look like? The hood's all uncrinkled now too. And once you get it washed, wait a couple days, you know, most of the gray's gonna go be gone. Uh -huh. where it's really thick, it's where it's really gonna stay. All right, let's just clean all my mess. And you're done. Pretty much. Just gotta peel the tape off and all the dents are completely done. Everything's straight. It's ready for paint or to be wrapped, whichever one I decide. And the sun's not even gone yet. Still got a shed of daylight outside. Get this thing unmasked. All right, everything's finished up. We've been kind of messing around, but about to pay this man. He did all this for $612. Paid him cash out. Cheapest that was easy enough. Around. Cheapest guy around. Rolling around anyway. <laughs> yeah, that's right. He did everything out of the bed of his truck. I had I had the power cable and everything here at the shop. He said, nah, I'll work out of my generator. So. Find me with the truck and the cardboard is, box. That's right. Get you pay it up and let you be on your way. All right, well, man, sure to appreciate yeah, it. I appreciate you. God bless. Guys, make sure. Thanks yeah. for the work. Hey, look, if y'all need anybody work done, make sure you hit these guys up because they're the real deal. He did it today. I'll drop this man's phone number and where he lives and stuff over in the description below. Say that who you're referred from. Yep. We'll send our man some cash for himself too. Hey. Everybody's hey. happy. Hey, y'all make sure you tell him that next shift sent y'all. All right, until next time, thank you guys for watching. Bye.